Hey, the folks got a new product for you. It's not a knife this time. This is uh, a slingshot that I ordered from uh, Andy, Doberman Knives. Um, it, it was a work in progress, um, uh, but uh, it was worth the wait. Let's just put it that way. Uh, I'll put the link below for um, Andy's uh, channel. He actually did a better... Uh, here, I, I did a better video on it, outdoors video, and it looks really good. But uh, uh, I just got it today. I figure I'll, I'll, I'll do some macros on it. So this is uh, G10. Uh, this is um, Tiger Stripe G10. Uh, I think initially he was going to get me like a blue, black Tiger Stripe. I forget which one exactly what he got. But for whatever reason, he got this one instead. This I, mean, I don't know if they sent the wrong one. But... I kind of like it. I kind of like this better because uh, it looks more tactical, looks badass. Um, so this is a Salios type uh, slingshot. Uh, it's got a red G10 core. And I mean, this is seamless. Andy's work is just amazing. It's got tie pins, which is a nice touch. And he contours it with the shape of the G10. That's amazing. That's great skill right there. Got a nice lanyard. Um, actually, when I hold it, my pinky kind of like falls in there. I think I hold it this way. Yeah. I kind of hold it this way. And the pinky kind of like just rests in there. I don't know if that's by design, but uh, it works pretty good. Um... Yeah, look at the contouring work that Andy does. Just really good. That's how he gets the different uh, shapes and layering on the G10. It's great skill. So, so I'm a product of the 70s. I'm a kid of the 70s. And um, when I was younger, really young, I'm talking about like five uh, my father used to make me uh, slingshots out of like a tree branch that was shaped like a, like a, like a Y, and he would just cut it out. You know, back then they didn't really have uh, production uh, slingshots that you can just buy for your kid. So my father had to be pretty uh, creative and just uh, he would make me slingshots and make me nunchucks, all at the tender age of five. <laughs> so when I saw Andy uh, did this work. I was prompt, I definitely want to order one right away, kind of just to reminisce about my childhood. Um, growing up as a kid, uh, we had like a koi pond in uh, my grandparents' backyard. And then when I was born, they were afraid that because the pond was like about three feet deep. My grandfather was concerned that because I'm a wrong, bunctious little terror fanatic, I might just fall into the pond. So he drained the pond got rid of fish, drained the water, and instead he replaced it with like millions of little pebbles. Perfect size pebbles. Perfect for ammunition. So I've never seen a fish growing up, but as a young child I used to play in this empty pond with all these pebbles, and then my dad uh, saw it fit to arm me with a, <laughs> with a homemade slingshot. And let's just say I had unlimited ammunition. No critters were safe from young terror fanatic. <laughs> I was a holy terror. But um, yeah, so this brings back memories. Thank you very much, Andy. Uh, of course, my slingshot was not as cool as this. I mean, this is just gorgeous. Looks like something Batman would proudly carry. Just look at that contouring work. Just really beautiful. Um, I highly recommend it. I'm not sure if he still has some... Uh, he had a couple of Salios made out of, uh, I want to say plywood, and he also had some made out of like a uh, really good G10. Um, you know, it's um, it's not very big. It's actually smaller than I thought, but it's, it's, it's a good size. I mean, when you, I got medium sized hands and you could tell it's uh, not very big, but it fits perfect in your hand. So, but definitely uh, if you guys want one, order one from Andy. You will not regret it. You will not regret it. Yeah, I'm psyched. Get on the rooftop. Take out some double parkers. Blocking my driveway. I'm just kidding. <laughs> All right, guys. So that's the uh, Salios 
from uh, Doberman Knives. Hit up Andy if you want to order one. Uh, he's also on Gear Bastion. All right, guys. Peace. Oh, before I peace out, look how cool this is. He gives you backup. Give me two more uh, straps with the uh, the leather. How awesome is that? That was a pre uh, that was a fairly quick piece out there, but uh, yeah, so pretty cool. All right, guys. Peace.